Good evening, everyone, and thanks for joining us. I'm Wendy Ryan. And I'm Jamison Euler. The search for a serial bank robber continues tonight, days after a Brinks armed guard and a Good Samaritan were shot during an attempted robbery outside of a credit union in Brandon on Friday. ABC Action News reporter Nicole Grigg finding out how investigators are trying to determine if the same person is behind the crimes. Our cameras were there today as two Brinks armed guards were inside the security truck. On Friday, the guard who was loading money into the ATM and shot was by himself. Investigators saying the suspected gunman matches the description of a serial bank robber. What does that say to you if it matches the description? Well, it means that they are consistent. So they're saying it could be the same person. It's likely the same person, but because they're not absolutely certain, they're not going to say it is the same person. Dr. Brianna Fox, a former FBI profiler. She says if this is all the same suspect, investigators are likely working around the clock. Two days before the attempted robbery here, investigators started a task force to try and find the serial bank robber. These are photos of the serial robber. This video from last October shows the suspect in a construction vest with a wig. We asked her if the FBI knows who the serial bank robber is. It's difficult to say I am not part of the investigation, but that being said, I do think that if they had some type of information, um, they would make it publicly available. She also says if this is connected, it's likely the suspect would stay local, and it's also likely he would try again. I would say this person is at high risk of striking again. If you have any information, call the Hillsborough County Sheriff's Office immediately. In Brandon, Nicole Gregg, ABC Action News.